Hello everyone! Welcome back to our channel 100 Ideas. A component approach to organizing the site allows you to freely place all the necessary buildings even in a small area. According to the current regulations, the total building area cannot exceed one-third of the entire site. Summer cottages should not only be comfortable and durable, but also meet the requirements of relevance and aesthetics. To do this, you need to take care of the compatibility of styles and materials used for construction. Brick houses should correspond to the same bathhouse, and wooden structures imply the construction of a similar gazebo. If the roofs of the main buildings are covered with metal tiles, then alternatives for the rest of the building should not be used. When planning a site, you must also take care of the comfort of your neighbors. To do this, you must strictly observe the recommended distances between zones and do not use high fences that can block the sunlight.
City dwellers often get tired of the constant hustle, so they are happy to spend their free time at summer cottages, where you can enjoy nature and fresh air to their fullest. When a person first acquires a suburban area, usually he has many interesting plans and ideas for its use. But don't be in too much of a hurry. To get a well-organized courtyard and a cozy area, you need to draw up a well-thought-out plan. All country houses require careful attention, only in this case the country house will constantly delight the owner. There are certain standards that govern the organization of development in the suburban area. The location of each building and structure should be noted on the plan. The center of the entire site and the steering point for calculations is a residential building. The zoning of the territory and the placement of their buildings on it depend on its location. The distance between buildings is determined by regulatory documents, which take into account the logic of the organization of the site and prevent the occurrence of possible problems with neighbors. Before starting construction, it is recommended to carefully read the building rules. The residential building is located in such a way that it is located as far as possible from utility structures. Otherwise, exposure to odors, dust and noise is possible. The recreation area and the reservoir are also located at some distance from the vegetable garden and building for animals. The same applies to the gazebo and barbecue. To hide from scorching sun under a beautiful canopy in the company of loved ones, enjoying the beauty and grandeur of nature, isn't it an ideal pastime in the warm season? A gazebo is a wonderful solution that allows you to get closer to nature, to become a part of it. Recently, designers have been offering various ideas to make the gazebo not only practical and comfortable, but also beautiful. How to make the gazebo become a decoration of the site? Find out with us!
wooden gazebo. Probably the most familiar and popular option that provides a wide variety of design is a wooden gazebo. Wood is an environmentally friendly and safe material that allows you to make a gazebo in any style, any design and shape. However, let's start with the technical characteristics of the building. Wood is an expensive, convenient and pleasant material to work with, which is safe and has an attractive appearance. Unlike modern materials that seem alien in the garden, a wooden gazebo merges with trees and flowers together, gives a sense of harmony and unity with nature. Modern antiseptics and protective impregnations will make a wooden gazebo reliable and its service life can be more than 25 years. In addition, wood allows you to realize the most daring and original design solutions. With the help of wood, you can make a gazebo in a modern, Russian or classical style. The shape and size of the gazebo are also limited only by the imagination of the homeowner, so that the structure can be either small or large, rectangular or square, six or octagonal. In any case, the structure consists of standard set of elements, namely foundations, support beams, support and transfer logs, roof. You can also use more complex elements to create an original and attractive gazebo. The main elements of a wooden terrace are a base, usually made of point supports, a supporting beam lag structure and a flooring. Additionally, significant deck heights may require additional steps and balustrades. Materials and dissemination of the quantity. As you know, the wood used to create various buildings and not only structures is diverse. As for the kind that are well suited for creating terraces, among them cedar and mahogany should be noted. The fact is that they perfectly resist the effects of moisture and microorganisms. Quite good options are pine and spruce, from which, with proper processing, magnificent sites are obtained. 
What kind of food to choose for the construction of a terrace is a matter of the availability of financial resources. However, as for the flooring, it does not make much sense for him to use a valuable and really expensive tree. A high quality pine is also quite suitable. After the final choice is made in favor of the type of food, it is necessary to determine exactly how much material. In order not to be mistaken in this important matter, experts advise to proceed as follows. First, draw up a general drawing of the future terrace. Then, calculate exactly how much wood is needed to make each of its elements, and then summarize all the data obtained. It should be borne in mind that after cutting long work pieces, there may well be scarps of considerable length that can be used. Choice of interior layout and shapes Having determined the functional tasks of the outbuildings, it is necessary to calculate its shape and layout. For example, a shed designed for storing agricultural tools should be equipped so that there is a place to store gardening supplies. There should also be enough space for frame movement, dragging large objects inside. If you plan to build a chicken coop, it is important to calculate the size of the building so that there is enough space for the bird, its life and nutrition, sleep and rest. When building a shed that serves as a workshop, it is important that it is comfortable to work at a workbench. Here, you need to provide shelves for storing parts and tools. If you work with wood is to be carried out in the workshop, 
then the width of the shed should be greater than the length of the workpiece and the length of the building is greater than its width. Having determined the configuration of the building and the minimum internal dimensions, you can proceed to choosing the shape, size and style of the economic building. In addition, many homeowners prefer to build a single unit that combines several functions, for example, a shower is combined with a toilet, and a summer kitchen and a garage with a workshop and a recreation room. The choice of combination depends on the preferences of the owner of the plot and what he needs more. As for ideas and projects, they can be found on the internet. You can also involve an architect or see photos of ready-made solutions presented in our material. We hope this video was useful to you. Like it, write your comments and subscribe to our channel.